the day, Inverness Highland Games. We are here all day, question and answers, stone demonstration, staying here chilling out. There's a massive queue waiting to get in. It's going to be fun, isn't it? It's going to be awesome. And this is the first time that you're out with your trophies, your two World Strongest Man trophies. Yes, We've kept it in the Highlands because we are Highland born and bred. So a huge shout out to all the people of Highlands. Thank you so much for all the support you've given us over the years. This is a little, I suppose, Thank you. Pay back to, to all you guys. So hopefully we'll have loads of people come down. Really excited for the day. So the weather's good as well, so fingers crossed the weather stays good. But rain, shine, wind, whatever it is, we'll still be here. We'll have smiles on our faces and we'll have fun. Cheers guys and we'll see you soon. We've got a little stall set up here. We've got Tom's World Strongest Man trophies. So pop along and we'll see you soon. The good people of the Highland Games have put the backdrop up here. This is where we'll be taking photos. Tom's got his two World Strongest Man trophies. So we're going to be taking photos with them as well. So should be a good day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'm just training with sync, but <laughs> oh, we're all right. Don't worry, I'll sell that. Don't worry. Yeah. Reason being, was that, uh, I got this. And one of the biggest cues here today, you cannot miss it, is of course for the Stolen Brothers. Back at the Highland Games, first time here, and what a cue, and what sun, sun is shining as well, so that's the main thing. I know, the perfect weather. What a fun success, and we're so happy, we're so happy to be here. So we just have MFR come in, and, which is a local radio station in the Highlands, and what to do, we chat about what we're doing here, a bit of chat about mental health, autism awareness, uh, etc, etc, so really excited to talk to them. The queue is pretty hectic, it's pretty hectic here, almost sold out already, which is insane. Thank you again for all the support, it means so much. <laughs> Inspire Highlands, they help uh, people with autism and stuff, so they've got a bear that helps. Hello, hello, you alright? Yeah, they've got a bear that they made for autistic kids and to help people with mental health, and they've given us a wee uh, cap and some uh, postcards <laughs> oh, from autism, so yeah, it's a cool, 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 uh, cool thing they're doing, so uh, we're gonna get a wee photo with them all now as well. Thank you. Nice. Thank you. Well, it's just nice, isn't it? I, knew, I, knew, I thought it'd be busy, but I didn't think it'd be as rammed as it is. It's, um, it's been open for half an hour, and the queue is just crazy. Really nice that people are wanting to support the brand, support the boys, and it just shows how much the hard work's like paying off. Because uh, yeah, really special. <laughs> There we go. What have you got? I don't know. Oh, it's not a hard gaff. It's not going to give me a fright, is it? No, I don't. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. Nephew does them. Oh, that's Stoltman. Oh, it's the, it's the photo of, uh, we'll leave it packaged just now, but it's a photo of Tom and myself with the World's Strongest Man trophy, Stoltman Brothers and Vergordon. That's banging. It's cool. It's cool. That is so cool. It's got in the office. Wow. <laughs> And who made this, sorry? Cedar Lynn. Cedar Lynn. That's so cool, man. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. That is class. <laughs> <laughs> you get one like that, don't they? Cheers, mate. Thank you so much, man. That they may take our lives, but they'll never take Freedom! We're going to do a live Strictly Come Dancing. Um, Tom's got his onesie on. Onesie, bro. Busy. It's good. I've seen it. You've not been out yet, have you? No. I think we're just it's official. Crazy, we're, we're not doing the stone yet. Walking across the grass, it's the only, the one and only Luke and Tom Stoltman, the Stoltman Brothers.
jam, boy. <laughs> It's only 23 pounds, so no shortcut. Right. Thank you for that. I was having a laugh in the video, you guys patting, talking about your mobility. <laughs> yeah, you need some mobility for that. What are you supposed to do with it? Tom's Tom just laid one of them in the, the cubicle. <laughs> the portal is. <laughs> is that where you got it from, is it? <laughs> Funny enough, yeah. It's just cool, you know, because it's uh, quite a get for. You know, if I go back if you want. <laughs> Come on, you know, right? Like, get him for a wee cuddle. It's just been cool because it's like Inverness is like the Highlands is where we're from. So to have people support us and come and see us and want to meet us, very humbling, I think, this type of thing because it's it is so cool. It just makes me want to do more in the Highlands as well, doing, doing this type of stuff. So have our own game, set up our facility, make Invergordon and the Highlands the mecca of strength in the world. I really think we can do that. So that's what this does for me. It just re reinstates that drive I have to really push the, the business and the brand. Um, so I'm really excited. I'm just clapping for myself. <laughs> Mr. Chieftain, you've got to welcome the crowds. Yes, I think it's probably as busy the as the Arnold's were. Yeah, thanks, thanks, thanks. Um, People just keep clapping for me, it's amazing. They really like what I'm saying, which is, which is very uh, heartfelt, so thank you, Highland people. I think we've got a presentation or something to do. And we've got to run back to the stand because there's like a big queue that they just we had to leave, and then they said they'd wait for us till we get back. So. Um, right, have we got that done? Yeah. And Crazy. two people who have served these Highland Games for so long, they couldn't be dismissed. And the first one is our dancing supremia, Elizabeth Fraser, of the Elizabeth Fraser School of Dance, who has been such a good to us every year. You thought that was going to be And she's a wonderful ambassador for dance in this area. A wonderful oh. thing. And I feel yet, I forgot about that. Don't forget a lot of you, I'm getting old. Today, we have a unique occasion. We have two lads so famous that if you go to Invergordon, if you, as you approach it, they say, Invergordon, the home of the Stoltman brothers. The two brothers, the two heavyweights, the strongest man in the world, and his brother who should, could have been the strongest man in the world. The Stoltman brothers, will you go out to have a presentation from our chief then. Big hand for this. Don't hold your hands. Nowhere else will you see. We're all standing together with you in the front row, boys. <laughs> Yeah, of course, yeah, yeah. She loves the boat. What? I'm your biggest fan. <laughs> oh, mate, look at that. Jeez. If you want to uh, be a guy in, then train with the guy Oh, that's awesome, man. Oh, but I was open, if you could sign this, and yes, I wanted sir. to be uh, tattooed on you then. Oh, of course, man. Yeah. So I said this yourself, yeah. Yes. Of course, man. I've got to do it nicely, then. So oh. as much as I could do not to cry, right? So oh, mate, I got to take another picture of it. 
Hey, man. Hey, hey, man. 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 Oh my god, he really makes you look small, Dan! Hello, you're rich. I'm sure, how you doing? Well, I'm sure, how you doing? Well, I'm sure, how you doing? Well, I'm sure, how you Oh, thanks, Blake. Give us a cut of it. Give us a cut of it. Come on. 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 Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for making the journey up. Appreciate that. Thank you. Oh, my God. You're perfect. This is the time. I think you're more skinny. I know, shit. Good going, guys. Oh, it's good. The burger's good as well. Mm. Yeah, it's been very, very busy, but it's been good. So many people from have come up from all over the place. England, Glasgow, Perth, Edinburgh, Inverness, it's unbelievable. I'm the stoke queues. I'm eating, so bye. That was wild. We literally haven't stopped. The queue is like it's mad. It's insane. Who would have thought? I didn't even think Inverness had that many people. Are you happy with the support though? I'm absolutely overwhelmed with the support that the people are showing. So, so a huge shout out to everyone that's come today. We're trying to make time for everyone, obviously. Really mental. You see guys with Stoltman socks on. Oh, no. Stoltman t-shirts. It's mad. You all right, mate? I'm in the socks, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Myself and Luke are, are challenging each other and going up against three other people from the crowd. To Inverness. Stone, we're gonna see who can throw it the first. I think the world record is 30 meters, there's no way I'm gonna, we're gonna get that. But as long as I beat Luke, that's the main thing, guys. An Inverness stone, oh, 23 pounds in weight. Okay, the current record for this is that white marker. It was set at the World Championships 2007. It's 13 meters 60. Gentlemen, that's your challenge. You guys get to take these guys on as well. It's not about how strong you are, it's about how athletic, how powerful you can throw these this stone. So, you fancy a challenge? Uh, Let's <laughs> try it. Two meters. I'll, I'll give you a little trick. These guys have actually had a little bit of coaching on this. I mean, I'm a rubbish. See if it's circle, it's uh, it's embarrassingly. Uh, no, no excuses, Tom. No excuses. Come on. If you get it past the first flag, you're doing well. <laughs> these guys over here, the heavies, will be taking part of this event after you. So you are going to set the bar for these guys to throw against. Okay. Oh, jeez! Oh, <laughs> hate it when people make banging noises. Who do you think should go first? Should we have Luke or Tom? Who do you think? Tom. You want Luke to go first? Tom. No, Tom. Tom, Tom goes first. Rock, paper, scissors it. Go for it. Right, rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three, shoot. 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 Ah, I knew it! Well done, Tom, you gotta go first. You go first. Only joking. How do you throw it? You must have. Oh no! East! 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 See if you beat me. You shave in your head. Okay. You can do whatever you want. You're rubbish! You're rubbish! What's your name? Desiree. Desiree. Oh, Desiree. So we have Desiree. What? Oh, Wow. Right, Gordon. Gordon. What are you doing? Oh. Oh, right. You are looking right. You actually tried. Alright. Right. 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 Wait till I pump my boots up. I want What's Misha. Misha? What a great name. Make sure when you're ready, Misha, you go. Really? Oh. Well done. You had so, Mr. Tom Stoltman, <laughs> take your stone. Are we ready to make some noise for Tom? No. no. I 
slip. 100%, 100%. Okay, yeah. <laughs> you well, your brother's beating you, you can't let this happen. He has to win something, doesn't he? He's got to win something. Oh. oh. It's a big crew. And Tom takes the lead. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, shaking the team. Are we having another shot? I don't know. I fired the first time. <laughs> right, Simon, we're getting one more shot. I've just got a good idea, so. What are you doing? Getting pumped up. <laughs> well, watch this. Of course it works. Come on, I have the tiger. <laughs> Got it further than the last time. If you're happy with I that, that's fine. Right. That's all that matters. You want to let Tom go first? Oh. Five. Everyone, I want everyone to say hi, Steve. Hi, Steve. <laughs> Steve is a big boss. Oh, oh. Oh. Mate, he's past you. No. Tom's a cheat. Tom's a cheat. <laughs> right, Steve, when you're ready. Oh, I'm Steve. Oh, it's a big big goal. So it's about five and a half meters goal. Ladies and gentlemen, please. Oh, you're off it, mate. 9.20 for Tom. <laughs> 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 I have to enjoy your problem, though, but yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, we get a quick photo here, yes, yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying, Carl? <laughs> I'm uh, not saying a lot. I'm saying my voice for the Q&A. Just showing when you went full time and you started commenting everything on YouTube, how did it feel, you know, after you're sharing your whole life with, with Strangers, basically, in a way. So, how, how did it feel? Was it awkward at first? Well, you, you know, that's not everything. Yeah, I mean, it was possibly the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. Obviously, you know, having autism my whole life, eight years old, strong man for me, I just thought was lifting weights, but I, I learned to like, realize it was much more than that. Then, when Luke said, let's start a YouTube channel, and uh, having to have these cameras follow my private life and having to have people follow my life around was possibly my worst nightmare. You know, if you look back at the old YouTube videos, I was saying two or three things. I'd let Luke take the lead. I'd let him do everything. My head would be down. It was the most uncomfortable thing I've ever done in my life. But then I realized, you know, if we want to grow this business, if we want to be who we are and be more than just straw men, I have to do this, you know, and it was uncomfortable for me at first, but I just kind of rid the wave and, you know, kept on going, kept on going. And now I'm probably the one that doesn't shut up now. So it's good, you know, it's, I mean, that's why I always try and say, you know, if you've got autism and stuff, you always have to try and put yourself in these uncomfortable situations and, the gym, this kind of stuff saved my life and uh, you know, I'm very thankful for it. How was that bro? That was good, good fun eh? Luke thinks he can beat me at a stone off, so right, no, just sorry, smash him up, yeah. <laughs> smash him up, yeah. But this community is what uh, built as you know, from day one, and uh, we love giving it back. And it's, I mean, it's that people just want to hear our story and want to take photos of us. It's uh, yeah, a very surreal moment for us. Where did everything go? I don't know. Some uh, crazy would just come and bought all their stuff. Got like five or six things left. It's very nice, yeah. It's quite nice to see how um, much people love them for some reason. I'm trying to, still trying to work that out. <laughs> This is a this is a first. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you good? Yeah. Oh, it's to see it. It's to see it. Oh, this is huge. It's scary, mate. Ah, oh, put it back on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, guys. How was the day selling merch, bro? Easy, bro. Nah, it was a very quick day. To be fair, we came in at nine o'clock. It's now 20 to 5, merch all done, and I'm getting a lift home. Apparently if I never sold it all, I had to walk home, so I actually started walking and had to come back. So. Thanks to me and Sinead, Sean didn't do much. <laughs> Liar! Yeah. The queue's finally gone. That is all the uh, photos and all the merch size done. We have got one more thing to do, the stone, and then it's 
kaput. Job done. So, been fun, been tiring, but it's been a great day. Thank you to everyone who came along. Thank you for the support and stay spicy. 115 kilograms. There's only seven men that did it, and I'm one of them. <laughs> and I'm one of them. Are you? Forget it's all about Tom. Look, stop it. Where's one of them boys? So, what are we doing just now? I think we're just gonna join the heavies and I think just see what uh, see we can put the stone over the bar. Hopefully I can because I'm not to touch the stone since World's Strongest Man, so and it's starting to rain. Well, the final event of the day is the Stonemason Stone Challenge, decked in history from a thousand BC. And here we are on the fields of Inverness. How heavy the stone is? How heavy is the stone? 217 pounds or so 115 kilograms. Can we do it? Probably not, but we'll try. Freedom! I lifted it off the floor, but I couldn't get up with it. Okay. You go first. Hey, it's time to leave a legacy. Buy our merch. <laughs> She never gives me anything, just throws it away. You're gonna do it topless? No. Two athletes gonna attempt this before the brothers take over. So here goes Ross. He's got it off the ground, he's determined. Let's make some noise for him. Two fifty-two. He doesn't look that old. <laughs> Give him a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Great effort. Well, it's only a rock. <laughs> Come on, in, Ollie. No. <laughs> no. He politely says no. I think we've got two little brothers at home. I'll give her a shot. You want money? So who's going to go first? Three on the second. Do not touch that ball. Come on, Luke. You're the man. 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 Come on, Luke. Oh, my heart was going there. <laughs> You should have put the bar to six foot. So, the world's strongest man is the world's strongest planet. No athlete has ever done it twice at the same time on the games field. I'll press it. Do you press it? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> they want to be the first set of athletes to clear this twice on a single day. So they <laughs> Don't touch your bar, Tom. Come on! No pressure! Let's make some noise in the rest! Come on, Tom. Because you are the champions. Try and press it. Yeah, try it. One more time. One more time. Thank you. Try and press it. Thank you, brothers, the chief team for coming along. And thank you, Amy McLeod, our manager, you, who's done such a good job today. And all the officials and all the helpers. Thank you so much. Tom's got some of the strongest shoulders in the world. He's going for the press. Come on, Luke. Here goes Luke. Come on. Oh, Desi, that's right. You can't do it, the other one's going to try. Desi, bud. They'll even do it, mate. Oh, Can you press it? Let's make some noise in the last. Oh, the world's closest man. Oh, wait. We find the limit. He's not finished. Is he going to hit that next? 
on the head. <laughs> the text of strength. <laughs> Boom. Done. One more. Let's go. Go on. <laughs> Strongest soldiers in the world! <laughs> He's in it. Anything I can do. Tom Patton. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. But it's easier than look like always. Oh, I can hardly breathe. That's the first time I've done at the stones since Worlds. And I felt alright, even though it's 115k. That is Inverness Highland Games done. It was absolutely amazing. Thank you to the guys for inviting us, for making it happen that we could be here, allowing us to sell our merchandise, to do the awesome talk. How was your day, Tom? Yeah, it was great. Like I said, great turnout, great people. Thank you again to the Highland Games for having us. Special, special event. And uh, guys, thank you so much for the support. Stay safe, smile, and stay spicy. Oh, please don't ever stop ringing that little bell. Ding -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling